man, Marvel Spider-Man, another video you've probably already fucking seen. Yes, it's a fucking great game, and I cannot lie to you. It's the best Spider-Man game for now. Now, it might be like, for now, and I'm like, there's a new Spider-Man game probably coming out. That'll probably be better than this, because you can't foreshadow at the end of your game and not give us more. And I, I think Insomniac wouldn't just make an amazing game everybody loves and not make another one. I'm a fight. I'm a, <laughs> yeah. I'm a Spider-Man fan, and I could say this is the, the perfect Spider Spooderman. It's a Spooderman game, guys. Best Spooderman. <laughs> the best Spooder. It's just a good Spider-Man game. How do they make Marvel Spider-Man so good? By fucking up the TV show and giving us more hope to watch the game. And watch the trailers. <laughs> I'm fucking mean. The show gets all this crap. And it's perfectly fine. But seriously. Like when you found out about Marvel Spider-Man. Were you not hyped? Were you expecting any less from Insomniac making a good game? Because... When this game came out, everyone was like, man, this is just, like, Batman, but, like, Uncharted. And I was like, wait, what are you talking about Uncharted? I'm like, oh, oh. I didn't even see it the first time around. I was like, oh, that makes sense. I, I got why it was Batman. And I was just like, oh, I see what you're going with. But no, you've been wrong. Oh, fucking Jesus Christ. I didn't expect a good Spider-Man game in a long time. I thought it was going to be the next, like, uh, fuck. There's a game that came out, and it was just so bad that it was just like, man, how you fuck up so bad? It was Halo 3. Uh, ha Halo? D I forgot the name of the game. I think it was Halo 3 with the, 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 the three different endings that aren't canon. I, I don't fucking know. I, I like there. There is many games that have failed, and they were just so hyped up, and then we were just like, I don't, I don't care. It was Sonic. Oh six, everyone was hoping not to be, because everyone was like, man, is this gonna be the Sonic Oh Six of Spider Man? So hyped up, and everything, and you're just like, fuck. But no, they they didn't fuck it up, and that that is. Let's just move on to gameplay. Jumpsuit. Slimming. Stay out of my business. Wait, the demons. Who's their leader? Keep my men alive and maybe I'll tell you. Oh man, you guys are back from that excellent gameplay? Exactly. It's good. And it's from a trailer? Impossible. 
How can someone... Oh, I, I don't know. It's just amazing. It's spectacular. Let me stop. You already saw the intro. You don't need to see it again. No, it, uh, the, now, the story of Marvel Spider-Man is... Okay. Like, it doesn't pull its own punches. It gives you the experience you need, and it's Spider-Man. Like, I, I don't think you can make any of the villains from Spider-Man to feel... Like, they're scary, except Venom, because Venom's not, like, human. Like, a non-human creature can be more terrifying than a human creature. Because, like, you gotta come up with murderers. And there's, like... Green Goblin. <laughs> and he's not important. Yet. Like, I, I love Spider-Man. But I'm gonna have to say the story isn't the weakest point. I think it's Mary Jane. <laughs> No, but it's 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 a simple story that works so well because Spider Man is a simple character. Now you might be like, Spider Man is not simple. He is. He's Spider Man. He's like Superman, but not garbage. <laughs> I know I'm pissing off Superman fans, but it's Superman. He's he doesn't have human character traits or anything interesting. Peter Parker is the is the average person who is a nerd. And he lives his life like an average guy. He's just an average guy who got lucky one day. And he lost a family member. But he remembers what they said. To use, to use their powers. Because having powers comes with great responsibility. And his responsibility is to help and save people's lives. And I think that is a wonderful way to work into any Spider, Spider-Man game. Is that Spider-Man will... Always know that great power comes with great responsibility and always want to help people because even some of the villains he'll help. And it's, uh, it's, it's it makes you sit down and think that you can't make Spider Man too complicated, that you only need a simple story to make the game great. And that's a lot of effort that a lot of game creators can do to make something simple but good. And I, I think that's where Insomniac came up with this best Spider-Man game. And I hope they'll make more because you don't leave us on a fucking cliffhanger. I, I swear to God. You don't leave us with, we're going to continue this. And not continue this. I would be, I would be furious. So, I, I hope we get this because I would be saying. Uh, see you guys next time? I'm an old man. Ugh, I take naps. I don't know. It's like 9 o'clock in the morning. It's, it's sad. Watch out!